across the room When our eyes met I never knew That I could feel this way And it's kinda strange Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. For today's video I thought I would take you along in a bit of a day in my life, just like general getting things done. So I really want to organize my bookshelf, it's kind of a hot mess at the moment and I want to go through it, put everything in like an order, figure out what I haven't read, what I want to read, anything like that. And I also thought I might bake some cookies or something along those lines, just sort of do like a cozy winter day in my life and I thought I'd take you guys along for the ride. We're also getting a delivery today. Thankfully, our washing machine is finally being delivered. We've been without a washing machine for like two weeks now and it is killing me. I am so excited for it to finally arrive. And also we are still in lockdown here in New South Wales and it's just been extended another two weeks as well. So we're in week three now and the two week extension means that I am definitely going to be in lockdown for my birthday this year. So. Kind of sucks, but you know, we've got to do what we've got to do. So yeah, let's get into it. So this is the current state of my bookcase. Like I said, it's a bit of a mess. There's no real order to anything, no organization. Some of these aren't even like their notebooks and things, which I have a different bookcase for now in my craft room office. So I should really move like those notebooks and like binders and stuff into there, I'm thinking. So I guess the first thing for me to do would be to pull everything out and start grouping things in sections and in piles, I guess. Also, this is like the perfect little like nook, like this little cubby right near, like off our master bedroom, but there is zero lighting, like there is not even a light up here or whatever, so it's like super dark. So I probably won't show you guys me taking everything out because you're just not even going to be able to see it properly. I'll just share with you when I get them all out onto the floor in my lounge room and we can go through all my books together and figure this out. Whew, that was some hard work but we are pretty much empty. I did leave the box sets like up the top here because I just feel like that's the best place for them because they're in their own little, little boxes so I just left them up there. And then these books are all super heavy, so like there's no way I can put them on any other shelves without risking them collapsing. So I've left them there too. But other than that, it's all empty. And here is all my books. Like, wow. I knew I had a lot, but like that's that's a lot. <laughs> overview of what we're dealing with at the moment so I've got all my I guess like young adult fantasy sort of 
type novels, my classics, and then these are all like my more adult reads, I guess, like the crime things and stuff, my non-fiction, my spiritual type books, and there's some more young adult books and magazines and comics. So now I've got them in their separate sections, I've got to go through each pile and sort of organise them and put them in a more, uh, I guess, pleasing order and then get them back into the bookshelf. So this has got to be one of my absolute most favourite notebooks that I have ever seen or found. I got it a few years ago I think and my idea is to use it as like a book of shadows type thing but it is just like it's handmade and it's just like it's gorgeous like look at these like how pretty like and this is like fully handmade pressed paper like wow progress this is basically where I'm at at the moment and I think I'm probably gonna leave it here for now so I've got basically all my like young adult type fiction novels here down the bottom is my husband's books I have like all like I said all those heavy ones that I left there I've got like non-fiction and like the spiritual witchy type stuff there and then the rest of my fiction here and I'm pretty happy about it oh and I also left this little spot here empty and this is going to be like my to be read section of the books that I currently have that I need to read and in some other good news the washing machine was delivered as well and it is like 70 kilos so that's gonna be fun for my husband and I to figure out how to get inside the house when he gets home <laughs> okay so now the bookshelf is done I am going to start working on the cookies so I believe the cookie dough needs to cool in the fridge for like at least 30 minutes so I want to get started on that first and it's got time to cool because I think that the longer you let it cool, like the more flavor you get from it or something like that. I don't know. But let's go start working on the cookies. To be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the ground You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me I won't be stumbling in the dark Your eyes are shining like the stars I was down until you saved me, until you set me free My eyes were closed, now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say that you can take me high Feels like I can fly You can take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow And I was down 
Until you saved me, until you set me free My eyes were closed, now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say Okay, so I've just grabbed the cookies out of the oven and they've been cooling for a little while, so time to give it a taste test. Mm hmm They're really good. Mm hmm I would definitely recommend making these. I'll leave the link. Gosh. I'll leave the link in the description box below if you want to give them a go yourself. And I think I might end the vlog here. So hopefully you've enjoyed spending the day with me and organizing my bookshelf and baking some cookies. Don't forget if you're new here to hit that subscribe button. I post weekly videos on bullet journaling, anything creative, lifestyle, all that sort of fun stuff. And give this video a thumbs up and hit the notification bell so you never miss an upload. Thanks! I, feels like I can fly Take me high. Feels like I can fly.